Hello everyone and welcome to Make the Burka, given to me by Creative Hand. Now I have actually played a little bit of this before, but for the sake of those who have never heard of this game, I will play it brand new just for you guys. I love that music so much. Okay. Hello. Sassy Walker. I like it. Okay, so. Pepper, cheese, onion. Uh, pepper, cheese, onion. Here is your burger, my darling. Cheese, bacon, cheese, bacon, ketchup. That kind of sounds like a burger I'd try. Mmm. Onion, bacon. Does it really matter what order we put it in? Mmm. -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna guess not? Question mark? Mm -hmm. Love the happy people. Okay, so what? If you guys haven't noticed already, you have to kind of memorize the orders that people put out because the orders don't actually show up when you're making a burger, which is a little tricky to those of us who forget quite easily. Uh, we will add tomato. Um, we won't use all these points up just yet. And it's sunny all day. Customers five or customers. No entirely sure that's spelt right there at all. We're out of stock. Come back another day. Okay. Ooh, happiness went down. Is that a good or bad thing? I like that little bin. Oh, I can turn music off. No, wait, I didn't want to do that. Uh okay, ketchup, tomato. Okay. I'm not entirely sure I did that one right. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Um, I'm not entirely sure of anything right now. Hang on, what was your order? Oh yeah. The other thing I dislike is that after a while that will disappear. So it makes it even harder and when they fold up. You can't actually see what the order was, so you're just left guessing. Mmm, mm, that sounds good. I have I think I messed that order up again. Mm. Oh, no, I was okay. But yeah, I actually like the graphic style. I like the music, as you can probably tell from me constantly humming the music. I like the art style overall, and I like the whole concept. But that memory issue bit is a bit hard hitting. Bacon, cheese, onion. Bacon, cheese, onion. You're making me hungry for a burger. Cheese, ketchup, bacon, cheese, ketchup. Was it cute? But it was onion. Why did I say bacon? Sorry, dude. Cheese, pepper, onion. What I would have liked is like um, mm -hmm. I know that you can fair you know work out instantly what you have to do. But a little bit of a tutorial just to get you into the swing of things would be nice. He's a big lad. Please don't kill me. I only try... I gave him the wrong order again, didn't I? Bacon... Oh, any, everything red. Good. No. What do you mean no? Did I not do it right? I didn't see what I did wrong there. And I don't know what the margin is for losing... Like, is it that you mess up a certain amount of orders, or is it that you don't serve them fast enough? I'm not sure. But my happiness meter's going down. I'm not sure if that's because I'm spending things, or if the customers are going to be more aggressive. Onion, pepper, ketchup. But yeah, people in the um, who are watching this video, write in the comments below. What kind of burger do you like, and what do you like on your burger? Who knows? Maybe I'll um, I'll um, add the right ingredient. <laughs> I'll make one for you. Mm -hmm. Uh, pepper. I a fish. I I really don't like black pepper because it makes me sneeze a lot. I don't like the taste of it either. But yeah, the game is a little repetitive, but I don't mind that. Oh. 
I, I'm just under, so I'm not going to buy anything. I'm going to save up until I've got that uh, thing. Also, I'm a bit concerned that my guy's sweating in the van just there. Oh, I dropped your burger. Wait, wait, can I... Can I not... Oh, oh, I've messed up a little there. Sorry, dude, I guess you're not getting a burger. I'm sorry, I've dropped it on the floor. I wasn't actually aware you could drop it on the floor, but now I know that's something I can avoid. No. Oh, I gave it to the wrong person. Oh, that, that, that's a pain in me. Wait, what was your order? Okay. You can tell that my memory is not the best. Uh, Peppa. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, as I said, it would be nice to actually be able to see the orders whilst you're making a burger because people, <laughs> a lot like me, always get confused. I wonder if this will be the moment where we get the extra bench. People can afford it. Also, it's a little annoying that you can't pick up the burger if you accidentally drop it. But at the same time, I can kind of understand that. Who wants a burger that you've dropped on the floor anyway? Then again, they, they're not going to notice if there's like um, a hair on the burger, are they? Let's be reasonable. They're not going to notice. Now my happiness has gone up. That's good. I kind of hope there was um, a way of making the burgers quicker, like a bit of a shortcut. But I guess that's not something we can do. I do like the idea of having to pick out ingredients that you want to add. Oh, we can afford that now. Oh, that went down a lot. I'm guessing that's like money. We'll see. Yeah, I like the idea of choosing what ingredients you want to add next. But I think eventually you have to get all of them to move on. The other thing is there is no room for... I messed up that order, didn't I? Sorry. The, there is an added issue where if there's more than one person waiting for their burger, they'll both have the same icon above their head. So you don't know which order matches which person. So that's a bit of a memory issue there as well. If it was had like, if they had like matching numbers above their head, say like that guy has one, the order says, the order says one on it, then perhaps it would make things a bit easier. But I suppose you could always add that to a different mode, maybe. I mean, I'm not, I'm not bashing the game. I really do like this game. I like games like this that are food based, that are um, you know, a bit of a strategy game. Simulation, rather. Um, I am a big fan of Cook, Serve, Delicious, Overcooked, those kind of games as well. And if anyone who's known me, uh, you'll know that um, I have got quite a bit of hours in those games. Not to say that I've actually um, put the videos on YouTube, but, you know, these things happen. Also, am I supposed to put the ingredients in a certain order for these burgers? No one's told me this. I'm just putting them in as I remember them. Alright, let's add some mustard. I actually like mustard, especially on hot dogs. So yes, people in the comments below, do let me know what kind of burgers you like. 
whilst I struggle to remember everything. Did I drop the burger again? I don't remember what was on his burger. Oh, I, oh, he's gone already. Also, do these people like disappear really quick? Or is it just me? Mmm, mm, yes. Put that in your mouth and enjoy it. Mm hmm. Also, is there any way to get like to maximize how happy the customers are? I mean, speedy delivery and getting the ingredients right is one thing, but is there another way of doing it? And I'm betting you guys in the comments below are gonna be like, "Yes, this is how you do it. You're not doing it the right way." Or that looked like sesame seed for a moment there. Or you guys are probably going to be like, yeah, you're doing it horribly wrong. Mm. <laughs> if the developer is watching this, I apologise if I am playing this completely wrong. I don't think I am. But at the same time, if anyone is watching that does play this game quite well and thinks they'd be able to help me out, um, mm. leave a comment below. Tell me what I'm doing wrong, what I'm doing right. And please take mercy on me. Mm. As you probably all know, my memory isn't the best. I forget easily. Um, is that a Star Wars reference? It says BB-8 back there. Alright, let's add sausage. I'd love to be able to get some hot dogs in. Can I have hot dogs, please? I'd be happy. I'd be very grateful if we could have um, some hot dog. See, you see that I had to switch out because I actually forgot for a moment there. When's the last time I actually had a burger? I can't remember now. I... Uh-uh. Uh He's like, no, you did it wrong. Who actually puts black pepper in their, in their burgers anyway? Is it like the fancy restaurant I'm thinking of? Mm-hmm. It would kind of be nice if they actually said more than mm-hmm and uh. But, you know, what was that? I think that's a critic. Yeah, that was a critic. The critics in this game, if you make them happy, they will make you happy. If you don't make them happy, it's disaster all around. Mm. I'm really enjoying the music, guys. Can you tell? To think I used to do jobs where memory was key. I, you can have mustard. I don't care. Have mustard. Is it a ketchup? I don't care. Go. Shoo. But yeah. Pretty sure that's a reference. You know what? Let's get some cheddar. I have a friend of mine who... Are we building something? We have built... Costel? Costile? Castile. What does it say? Oh, now they made it hard. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. No, my memory's gone down the drain. Australian burger? Okay. Never had an Australian burger. No, no, memory's gone out of my head. Okay. Hang on. No, no, it's gone completely out of my head. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, so... This is where everything goes horribly wrong. Mmm, yes. Mm. <laughs> I don't know why I keep mimicking them. The, people in the comments below, can you actually tell me what... Ooh. Different kinds of bread. There we go. I was wondering what they sold there. Oh, you're still there. But yeah, people in the comments below, can you tell me what an Australian burger tastes like? Is there actually any real difference? Or is it just the way it looks? But yeah, remembering more than three ingredients is getting really tricky here. Also, everyone, I do apologise for the lack of um, content that's been out recently. 
I have unfortunately um, been a little ill recently, so my health pr is prioritised. So I apologise, but at the same time, you guys have got to understand, I've got to put my health first. I gave him the complete wrong burger then, didn't I? Yeah. These, these guys leave very fast. You, you know, you if you want a burger, you have to be a bit more patient. Um, I actually wonder what would happen if I didn't take any orders. But then again, that's probably not the best idea. But yeah, about the memory issue, that, um, I have spoken to the developers, who are actually really nice people. And they have said that they are working on fixing, the, uh, sorting out a memory issue, so it's a bit more playable. So kudos to the developer, developer, because they do listen to people and they are looking into um, making an update to make it a bit easier for everyone all around. I don't know if it's going to be a, uh, when that's going to happen. Is that a door there? What is that door? Death section. Oh, okay. Maybe we should just leave that. But they are looking into fixing everything. But unfortunately, that is all I have time for at the moment. So as said, um... There is a slight memory issue as time goes on, especially when the orders get a lot more longer. If the developers can put the um, orders into the burger creating screen, it would make the game so much easier and I will be able to change my review on the um, store page as well. Because although I do love this game, it can be a bit tricky to remember everything, especially when you've got so many orders coming in and you've got a load of customers coming along. Also, um, it would be nice to know how long you've got until the customers disappear and to know how much of an impact customers leaving has on your business. But anyway, this has been Make the Burger by Creative Hand. If you guys like the content I put out, link to my coffee is in the description below. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!